Hi guys, welcome to the second part of my do-it-yourself um, mountable GoPro gimbal video. In this video I'm going to guide you and show what is actually inside of this uh, case. So as you can see I removed GoPro and I unmounted uh, the mount from my selfie stick. So first of all uh, as you can see here I reused uh, these two screws so uh, so the tricky part here is uh, not to break all this wiring yeah, I'm going to explain step by step everything I have here so First, let me unplug my servo motors and let's, yeah, detach this. Okay, so really carefully taking this guy out Oops. okay cool so now we can remove these wires as you can see here I have a hole for wiring okay so now let's remove the power switch okay and now finally we can take out the, the board actually And let's unplug the board here. So uh, here as you can see the mount itself. But the most, most interesting part is here, so uh, let's remove this tape. And this tape is complete, is, this tape is necessary because I figure out when you pack all the wiring inside the box, it really affects the signal and well, it just stopped working. Okay, so as you can see here, a uh, few modifications. So first of all, I unsoldered the, those pins, those motor pins, and replaced them with uh, this, this male, I believe, part of the... Uh, this so-called uh, servo motor extension cable so I took this part because wires are flexible and I can fold them and I can't fold metal pins and second uh, I also unsoldered uh, these pins I believe those pins uh, will uh, like joystick pins. I'm, I actually still plan to have a joystick here but then I just going to use the same technique as here. I, I will just use uh, some more extension cables because I ordered them in a batch of 10 so it's like more than enough for my experiments. Um, so uh, let's see what do we have here. 
So yeah, as you can see here, it's just a simple uh, on-off switch. So uh, and nine volt uh, battery adapter. Yeah, and that's pretty much it for internals of this part. Again, thanks for watching and see you next time.